Hello, I'm David O'Loughlin, the Mayor of the City of Prospect, and welcome to the quick summary for our meeting for February in uh, 2018. Uh, a pretty long agenda tonight, so uh, hopefully you don't have to read every item as we have. It's uh, several hundred pages long. A couple of uh, quick snapshots. Um, tonight we received a petition from the people living along Angwin Avenue Prospect about uh, wanting to have some traffic management along the street, and I think there's some real issues there for us to look at. Uh, for those of you interested in car parking in the Village Heart uh, here, uh, where I'm doing the video at the Council Chambers, uh, we have had some issues with uh, some parking signs uh, behind some shops, and there's a very detailed question and answer provided in the minutes if you're interested in that matter, because uh, of course uh, parking restrictions on private land always uh, make us think twice about whether it is actually legal or not. Uh, we had a number of items on the agenda uh, which are going out for consultation. Uh, including our, uh, our park strategy, which covers every park within the city. If you're interested in parks and open space, please have a look and give us your feedback about that uh, very important paper. Uh, we have an investment attraction strategy as well that's been developed uh, in conjunction with the town of Walkerville, and that's for North East Road and for Main North Road, and I think it's a really powerful piece of work, and that will guide our work in uh, attracting uh, business investment and development on those two strips uh, for some years to come. Uh, we had a uh, licensing and leasing policy that covers all of our uh, community halls, meeting spaces, uh, sporting club rooms uh, and the like across the whole city. That's been revised and that will allow greater flexibility in uh, uh, sub-tenants and for um, all sorts of leasing that we don't currently have in our current policy. So please, if you're interested in one of those clubs and interested in the uh, leasing policy, please have a look and give us your feedback. We really appreciate that. Um, the Broadview Oval fitness track design is finalised. Council has agreed to it tonight. That work is going to happen before June 30. That would be great. We have a whole pile of fitness equipment on there as well. There's some really good papers uh, in the agenda about the status of the new facility going to be built right where I'm standing. So if you're interested in where that's at and the big issues associated with it, including the whole risk register, if you want to have a look at that, please check that out in the meeting papers. Uh, a few other items as well. I guess uh, the, those you'll find in the agenda if they're of interest to you. Uh, can I just point out two more information reports that might be of interest? Uh, the first of those is regarding the Gig City announcement for uh, our city uh, and uh, us being part of the Gig City precinct. There will be a 10 gig precinct here in, uh, on the Prospect Road Village Heart. Uh, and you never seen those Mirani cakes move so quickly down the fibre, I tell you. Uh, so we're very excited about what that'll mean for Little City, for the Business Hub, for the tenants in the Maris building, for the tenants in our future building here, for the tenants in the office building that's going to be built next to us, and the one above the newly approved uh, Foodland Shopping Centre. So uh, that's terrific news for us. And a couple of other information reports about how we're going against our strategic targets and how we're working with the other Eastern and Region Alliance councils. I'm sorry, there's a fair bit to cram in in a very short video. I um, hope you're well, I hope you're going to have a great month, and I'll catch you next month in March. But if you want any information about any of those items, please check out the agenda or give us a buzz here at Council. Thanks very much. Bye for now.